Okay, the new DMC bike. First off, new Mongoose cranks. Haven't ridden them yet, but from the looks of them, they're going to work great. Outlanders, mini ramp riders, I guess riders in general rejoice. 990 tabs, forks. A sight to behold. Yeah, I put that baby over to check out the bottom. Steer there. tube, one solid piece, machine down. No more breaking it inside there at the headset where you can't see. Supposedly some kind of double heat treating. I'm not an engineer, never made it that far through college, but supposedly they're heat treated first, then they're bent, then they're heat treated again, and that's supposed to make them super extra bulletproof. I'll find out when I test them. Down here, standard type peg mount, nice flat surface. I guess it beats taking a DK stem and drilling it out every time like I was doing before. Uh, what other features? Let's tip the bike upside down. You can zoom in on these nifty little caps on the bottom of the forks. You do a grind, you slip over too far, you can just grind right on the cap there because it's shaped just like the peg. It's going to be nifty on the production models. This dropout will be dropped just a tad so that the dropout will hang beneath this. So you're not going to tear up that with some of the 270 to Smith grind kind of stuff that's out these days. Pedals, check this out. Brand new parallelogram design. I don't know where those engineers at Mongoose came up with this but they took some sort of parallelogram shape. It just works good. You have to try it to believe it. Everybody everybody out there is going to want a pair of these pedals. Nothing. I can't wait to get it home and ride it. All right, well, thanks, Dennis. Cool. Thank you. We're not using a brake. You just poke on the front wheel. Do that. You spin the bike around. Yeah, we're going to still go on it. All right, let's see Dennis going. Oh, yeah. Nice here. Did you guys see this?